tina tata uh, tina tata urungi nga tini ahua tango te wā uh, mori ora kia tata uh, ko faka miningana mai nei iti nei rangi uh, kita faka nui uh, mete hoki mahara iti nei unga koi papa iti nei rangi mure huri no tina tata uh, tina tata urunga no te reo unga tua huri te tua ke nei uh, naia kunga mihi uh, otomato nei runanga me te hapu unga tua huri te e rere kauana kia tātou hurinoa hurinoa tēnā tātou katsu. I te premier kōrua uh, kia koe te worship koutou tātou katsua e tau nei uh, nau mai hoki mai. Hoki mai ki tēnā o ngā kaupapa he kaupapa whakamaharatanga a kia rātou mā koe mini atu rā ki te pō uh, ki, kia whakatū tēnei tohu uh, hei mai mahara. Nō reira uh, mihi ana, mihi ana kia tātou. Uh, nō reira hei huaki, hei timatanga mā tātou Katsuku ngā reo whakamui me te kito tātou matu i tarangi. Nō reira kia inoe tātou. He honore he kororore ki tō ingoa tapu e he pā. Nei mātou e kononga e tukua na ngā reo whakamui me te kia koe, kia uhia mai to tō mai rangi atapai ki rungi a mātou i te nei rangi. A whina tia, manaki tia mai mātou i roto i ngā mahi mo tēnei kaupapa, ke eke panuku, ke eke tangaroa, ke te keo keo ngā o tō mātou a reke aura ke tū mai ake. Nō reira e pā ko koe te timatanga me te mutunga a tōrua te tōringa ta whae ki runga pau a ngā tau i ngā marae maho te motu kia rātou te rau e kore te pangi rātou i mā wiwi ana Nō reira e pā e honore he kurore ki tō i ngoa tapu a ki tōna watu, āmi E honore he kurore a mā ngā rongo ki te whenua Whakaaro Hai Ki ngā tangata katoa Aki o aki Aki o aki Aamine Te atu Tau te rangi Māori a te wāhi ngaro ki rungi a tātou katsua, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, huri nō tēnā tātou katsua. Kia ora tātou, haramai ki tēnei wahi, haramai ki te au Otakaro, no mai haramai. The importance of today's event is reflected in the importance of the people who are gathered here today. I think we have the Prime Minister, Ministers uh, Brownlee and Wagner, uh, the Mayor of Christchurch, the Honourable Leanne Dalzell, uh, the Chair of Naitahu, Samak Solomon. Uh, there's also everybody else here, including most particularly uh, representatives of families who lost loved ones at the time of the February earthquake. I welcome you all. Uh, today we're going to have uh, three people speak with us and then we'll have the traditional and ceremonial uh, turning of the site at the start of a, a major project like this. So can I first invite the Prime Minister, Right Honourable John Key. Kia ora tātou, rauranga tērā mā, tēnei aki mihi mō te kia wana tanga nga henera, kia ora huuhu tātou katoa. Can I acknowledge all of the dignitaries here today, obviously mā, uh, and uh, the members of uh, Naitahu who are here today, Leanne, it's great to see you back here, acknowledge my ministerial colleagues. Uh, today is, I think is a very important day and yet another step forward for the city of Christchurch because uh, there are tremendous things happening in Christchurch. We've been over the road uh, just looking through the terraces uh, and then earlier prior to that looking at the Margaret Mayhe uh, playground that's happening. So we can, around us we can see tremendous progress. But as we uh, look forward to that progress, it's also very important that we poise and take a moment to look back. Uh, we should and must never forget uh, the tragedy that took place in Christchurch, uh, the well over 180 people that lost their lives here, uh, many who were injured, the great suffering that those families have gone through. When I uh, first saw the design for the wall that's going to be erected here, I thought they'd done a tremendous job. Um, I think it's uh, a great way 
of being able to have people from not just Christchurch but actually around New Zealand and around the world stop, pause and reflect on the tragedy that took place as part of the Christchurch earthquake. So I think it's a tremendous design and it will be a place where people will come for a solemn reflection and an opportunity to understand the history of the Christchurch earthquakes that took place. Uh, there is a lot of uh, incredibly um, positive development happening in Christchurch and uh, uh, the more I see the new buildings be er being erected and the new facilities being created, I'm confident that that uh, claim that Christchurch will be New Zealand's uh, most livable city will live up to uh, being true. Uh, but it is important that we have a time and a place uh, that we can reflect on the loss and that's what the memorial is all about. So I want to acknowledge uh, the Slovenian architect that is responsible for uh, the design, those that chose the design because I think they got it absolutely right and wish everyone all the very best in the construction of the memorial wall. Thank you for having me. Thank you, Prime Minister. I'd like, now like to invite the Mayor of Christchurch, the Honourable Leanne Delzell. Leanne. Ena mana, ena reo, ena iwi tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā ratato katoa. Uh, Prime Minister, thank you for being here today. It is an important day on our journey of recovery as a city. Uh, Sir Mark Solomon, again, uh, part of a triumvirate of uh, people who came together to work uh, with the design uh, of this memorial. Uh, parliamentary uh, representatives, um, the Honourable Jerry Brownlee, our Minister for Earthquake Recovery, and the Associate Minister, the Honourable Nikki Wagner, who has delegated authority in this area. We have met together, um, the three of us together, the City, the Crown and Naitahu, to work together about choosing the memorial that will be the place where we will gather as a city in the future. It was interesting that uh, We've been having the conversation about where we hold the February 22nd memorial because this year coming, it's the fifth anniversary and that's going to be a very um, challenging time for a lot of people. And um, in a way, we, we're looking forward to the day when we will be able to gather here. What I really like about today is that we're breaking ground on this side of the river because this side of the river is really about the families who lost people on the February 22nd um, fateful day and those who suffered injuries and those who experienced loss, loss that we can't possibly begin to imagine. The whole city has been affected by what occurred, but there are people who've been engaged in a conversation about how this side of the ri river could provide that quiet place of reflection and contemplation that will make the memorial on the other side of the river even more meaningful and special to the city as a whole. So can I thank all of the family members that contributed to the conversation that led to a, an easy decision for us to make. And in many respects, it was a perfect decision-making process because we didn't get to make a decision at all. We confirmed the decision that was made by the people. Nō reira, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā ratatou katoa. Thank you, Mary Ann. And uh, Sir Mark, welcome you to the rostrum. Naitau have been important in blessing this place prior to this, and welcome. Heta mea, heta pere mea, Ngā minita, koutou ngā whānui whānui Ko taimai i tēnei whakamaharatanga o te motu mo te rū o Waitaha To all that have come here to the Canterbury Earthquake National Memorial Today provides us an opportunity to come together To continue to remember those whānau that we deeply miss Following the devastation of the earthquakes As work commences on the memorial We can reflect on how far we have already come in our journey Of recovery and equally on how far we still need to travel together as we rebuild our community. I think this river, the Ōtākoro, the Avon River, helps us to reflect 
that has supported Ngātahu and the other tribes for centuries and will support all those who come to this memorial to reflect both this generation and the generations to come. I also notice that around us there is a sense of the city regenerating, a sense of momentum, perhaps so the timing seems right that we should be ready to turn the first piece of ground at this site. This will be a busy place for a while as the building and landscaping gets underway but there will remain an underlying sense of tranquility and when the memorial is completed that tranquility will restore and replenish us as we gather at this site to remember those we lost in the journey that we have made. Nā reira, ki a rewaina te waka whakamaui e tō kihi whakamua hoiatu, hoiatu he haumanu. Let us launch the waka of our recovery forward, each paddle moving us closer to a real awakening. Nō reira, te nā koutou, te nā koutou, a tēnā rā tātou koutou. Manu, tiria, manu, tiria, manu, wherohia ki tō poho atraka. Kato e re re kato i koe vi e ta re ho ia koe ia koe ia koe ia re re ki ki ma e ma vi e ta ra i te fitu me te waru e e ta e koe ia koe ia te nora koe ia. I think there's something deeply symbolic about that shower, Mark. It says a lot. Uh, it's the Atua looking after us. It's the Atua looking after us. This is the tears of the ancestors. Um, I'd like, now like to invite the Prime Minister, the Mayor of Christchurch, and Sir Mark to come forward and uh, to use the spades to uh, initiate the project. Yeah, that's right. Yes, we have had a dry spell. <laughs> I thought the rain would help. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much indeed. Well done. I broke the ground. Yeah, broke the ground. Well done, Leanne.